What's up, buddy? How you doing? Uh, I, I hurt my leg. Yo, so get this. I was playing basketball yesterday, crossed some dude up, and uh, he tried to, like, without breaking his ankles, trying to get me. He need me in, like, have you ever got, like, a trolley horse? Like, somebody, like, dead legs you, but his whole body came down on it? I, can't, I haven't been able to move it. It's only been, like, not even 24 hours since last night. So this whole leg is, like, numb. <laughs> we'll, we'll walk around that. We'll probably do an upper body circuit. Okay, cool. When was the last time you trained upper body? Beginning of this week. Beginning of this week. Which muscle group? Uh, shoulders and back. Uh, we'll incorporate all the other muscle groups into the upper body circuit. Cool. That way you can rest your leg. Max doesn't like excuses. Yesterday I was like, yo, my leg's gone. I can't work out. He goes, no, no, you could. He's like, we'll just, we won't work out your right leg. And I was like, what the hell does that mean? I was like, okay. Let's get going, yeah? You did it. For real, help me out. Yeah, All right, so Max and I decided today that we were gonna go to the zoo culture gym. The reason is why. They have stuff not a lot of gyms do. Like Equinox doesn't have half this equipment. LA Fitness doesn't have half this equipment. Uh, it looks like an obstacle course in here. So uh, we're about to put George to that obstacle, take advantage of this equipment that he doesn't usually have access to, and uh, max out results. Let's go. I go, it hurts, but I can do it. He goes, okay, do it. <laughs> I was like, I be like, no, don't hurt yourself. Like, look, he got a Charlie horse, right? High impact right here. It's super sore right now. If you don't work it, it's gonna be worse. It's gonna get worse. We're incorporating abs in between the exercises. That way you don't have to do abs before, after the workout, just throw it right in. I like to use body weight exercises, get warmed up before we throw in the weight. All right, so. Uh, uh, less weight than I usually work out with, and I'm more tired because we're not taking breaks. Yeah. We're just like going into the yeah. Like George said, the exercises are harder right now because he's taking shorter breaks, but he's also burning more calories. Burn fat, put on muscle, same time. Workout was upper body. We have to cut out the legs. George injured himself, as he told you. So uh, we'll be back to use multi gym, but we we'll get something to eat. What do you want to eat? Uh, this is a good chicken spot. So two chicken breasts and uh, brown rice is what I believe. And I have avocados. Yeah. Oh, you gonna eat at home? No, it's a restaurant right next to my house. Let's go. to this there's nothing we just literally talk but the way she just talks I don't like a really bad actor yeah cuz that I, I, was I, delicious <laughs> <laughs> what, what did you even say You're like that was delicious thank you for taking me and then he smiled at me. but yeah so we went to a restaurant and uh, I got a lot of protein out of it I got two chicken breasts I got some nice rice and I guess my avocados um, avocado was delicious I'm definitely it was, but you didn't finish those yeah, I did. I ate mine on the way here. Oh, uh, you 
just save it like a snack, huh? Wow. How often do you eat there? I've been eating there every day. Every day? Yeah. You stop cooking? Yeah. Why? Uh, I don't have time. I say if you can't cook your own food. Options. So like, have the chef, get food from the chef only like maybe once or twice a week. Yeah. And then fill up the other days with other options. You know what, Max? I don't like when you're telling me what to do like that. I'm definitely just giving you <laughs> options. You're gonna make it, have to make a decision, you know? Yeah. What sure. are you gonna have for dinner tonight? You're not going back to the same chicken spot. Why not? Are you? Maybe. Is that, you get tired of eating the same thing. Plus, like I said, Oh, what about ground beef, by the way? I, I want to have kebabs and stuff, but no rice, no nothing. Are, no are you preparing it yourself? No. But it's just lean ground beef. I have lean ground beef myself. But it's hard to burn off that. I'm not trying to burn fat. So, like, for you, chicken and fish. Fish? Ooh, I haven't had fish in a while. Tuna is, is it lean? Tuna is lean. Yeah, but the tuna from Subway is probably not lean, yeah? Uh, if you're going to have tuna, I'd say prepare it yourself. Uh, all your meals. I don't know how to prepare tuna. You put tuna in the oven or in a, in a pan and it cooks itself. This is this guy. I don't, I don't cook and I, I still cook fish. So <laughs> it takes some time. So you're definitely taking diet more seriously. With uh, whenever I get super hungry on set or if I'm like around the house, instead of me going to like in and out and stuff, some days instead of going back to in and out, I'll be like, you know what, I'm just gonna have a protein shake before bed and I'll just down a protein shake. Protein shakes look cool. Add them to your you know, nutrition plan. By the way, I, since I just had but, two chicken but, breasts, do I need a protein shake right now? No, right? So that, that, that's a question like I want you to answer. Help me help you. Okay. Help me help you. Girl, what you trying to do? George, you need, you need a certain amount of protein per day. Um, meal prep, meal prep, meal prep. You gotta plan ahead. Protein shakes are gonna help you. They're not there to replace the foods. Uh, you still wanna maintain muscle. We don't want you to get skinny, so. Um, Cool. Alrighty guys, that is going to be it for today's episode. So the moral of the story is there might be uh, obstacles, got to overcome them. There's going to obstacles in the kitchen, you got to overcome them. Just because I didn't plan on hurting my leg doesn't mean I didn't plan on going to the gym. Just because I didn't plan, what are you doing? I got this guy's trying to cuddle me. I got you, but I got you.